Are you ready? I am. Let's go. Hello, Hey CISD family, and welcome to this special edition of Right This Minute. Today, uh, we are joined on set by Crystal Martinez, by powerlifting coach here at Lehman, Fred Rodriguez, and by athletic director, Lance Moffitt. And today, we are here to honor and showcase, showcase Crystal's great work um, as being, in my history of being a superintendent in over 20 years, the first student athlete that has ever won a state championship four years in a row. It's pretty incredible. It felt really good winning it this year because it's my last year. So I was like, go big or go home. <laughs> and I got what I wanted. I wanted to be able to finally get best outstanding lifter. It took all four years and I finally got it because that's a hard award to win. <laughs> that's best out of everybody. <laughs> Uh, Crystal has put in nonstop work. All, I mean, we practice year round, and Crystal's there every single day, you know, working, working to get better, working to, to win, make her teammates better as well, you know, helping support them. Um, but, you know, to win this outstanding lifter award, you know, uh, finally her senior year, uh, it's, it's a huge accomplishment, you know, and it's, it's the state powerlifting meet, so there's a, it's the best in the state. And, you know, Crystal, you know, with, with how much work she's put in, you know, she, she deserves this award. It took a lot of dedication and hard work. It also took a lot of practice time, being there, doing everything. And especially freshman year, that, that was a really hard mental game because everyone was so close to each other and I won it just by a couple pounds. Yeah, so what we do just to make sure that they're prepared going into every single meet, you know, that week of, um, you know, like during the regular season, um, you know, we start with openers, make sure that they can hit a, you know, just an opening weight just to get their confidence going and then build up from there, build up from there. And as the season progresses, you know, we, we increase that weight, you know, they should be getting stronger as the year progresses. And then, you know, when, when we get to regionals and state, you know, that's when uh, a lot of lifters, you know, that's when the mental toughness comes in. And uh, Crystal, you know, being a three-time regional champion, four-time state champion, man, she's, she's got the mental toughness to, to make it through. So, you know, she got it done. It feels really good. Like, all my hard work really paid off. Yeah, I, I think it's a huge accomplishment. Um, it, it really elevates um, our district, Lehman High School, our powerlifting programs at, at all of our schools. And, and it's just a testament to the program that Fred has built and the program that Crystal's been a part of the last four years. Um, individual sports are often um, not as are notable as the other sports, and and just the idea of hitting a PR. Uh, Coach mentioned it, hitting a PR every week, um, and then to, to multiply that by four years and think about in an individual sport doing your very best and then topping that next week and next week and next week and then times four years. It's just a huge accomplishment and a testament to their work ethic and to hear Coach talk about her leadership and how it elevates the rest of her team. The greatest thing about individual sports is when you can infuse the team mindset into the individual sport and uh, coaches programs and, and for that matter all of our powerlifting programs um, display that and so this is just a great recognition for that and our district and we are extremely proud and happy for her. My plans post-graduation is to go to UTI and go to the welding course and then once I'm done there fully settled maybe have enough maybe I'll go back to university to see what holds there because I have a scholarship being held for me at one of the universities. And powerlifting wise, I'm gonna compete outside in USAPL. So just do it, <laughs> just go on. Just if you really wanna do it and you really wanna like get better, just, just do it. Do your own thing, make your own path. Don't follow somebody. Make your own path, because if you make your own, you'll go farther. Absolutely, no, I couldn't be prouder and um... You know, I know Crystal's being a little modest, but she had to sacrifice time. Um, she had a, a stringent workout schedule. She was extremely disciplined. She had to maintain her weight class. Um, and she did this not just one year, not just two years, not just three years, but four years in a row. This is unprecedented. And, um, and she's being very modest, but 
Um, I think that uh, she's an inspiration to um, future students that may want to go into powerlifting. And, um, and, if, and if I were them, I would reach out to Crystal and find out what her playbook looks like and I would follow it because um, I, think, um, I think just there's proof in the pudding. I mean, look at all the hardware on this table and, and I couldn't be prouder. And so with that being said, um, I want to add to uh, the hardware that she's been uh, been receiving uh, by hard work, and I just want to say on behalf of Hay CISD and and personally as a superintendent, um, I want to give you the superintendent's coin of excellence because um, I'm just um, overwhelmed at how awesome you are. So congratulations, we're proud of you. <laughs>